Hello and welcome back to the Proclaim online course. My name is Benjamin Denny and I'm going to be showing you today how to set up your outputs for Proclaim so that you can, you know, actually pr uh, present and use this in a service. Now the way this works, and I, I'm actually only currently set up on one display here, but I'll show you how to set this up. So the way Proclaim works by default is that you have a presenter view, which is your view, and then you would uh, normally have a projector or a TV or something that would be connected to your laptop or desktop machine that that would be the actual output. So in my case, since I'm on a Mac, I kind of have these virtual displays here. I can see over here what um, is, is being outputted. So to configure this, go to Settings and Display. And then you'll see that we have these various things here. So virtual screens. Um, we'll have to cover some of these at a different time because it doesn't exactly tie in. By default, you're going to have slides. And that's the most important one is to make sure that you have that. Confidence is for a back screen. So if you have um, a screen on stage or a screen that people on stage can see, that would be the confidence view. I'll, I'll show you that shortly. And as you can see here, I only have really one output. And so it's outputting right now to slides. Um, we could add a custom output and we could say it's an NDI output. Um, we'll have to cover that another time, but that's how you can get into live streaming software pretty easily. Um, it's over the network. It's basically a virtual output. We'll have to cover that another time. But as you can see here, default um, display slides. And so if I come over here, um, it's going through our announcements. I'm actually going to close this quickly and pull up a song just so you can see. So here we are. Now, if I actually switch this up at the top to confidence view, then I'm previewing right here what that confidence monitor is, that confidence output. But obviously on the main output, I'm still seeing the main one because that's what's set up under the settings. So if I click display zero and however many displays, however many outputs are connected to your machine, you'll see all of them here and you can select what you want them to be. So if I select confidence, now this this output shows that confidence view right here. So as you can see, if I connected uh, another monitor, which I will shortly, then you will be able to actually have that show up here. Let me go ahead and do that and I'll bring you back. Okay, so I've just connected another display, another output, and as you can see, I have my main laptop display, which is the application. It's not used. This is where the application is going to be hosted. You can use it, but it could cause some issues. Then on display number one, I have the slides, and then on display number two, I have the confidence monitor. Now, so with that being said, that's that's really all there is to it. I don't want to overcomplicate it. So um, you just need to set up your displays by going to settings, displays, and configuring those outputs, and you're ready to go. Now, I would recommend that you, you know, if this is going to be your first Sunday doing this, go ahead of time, set this up, make sure it works, make sure that you understand how it works, and then you're all good. So with that being said, hopefully this video helps you set those displays. And if you have any other questions, uh, feel free to reach out or leave a comment below.